Artemis, this is Dr. Crane. You're probably surprised to be hearing from me. I promise I wouldn't be reaching out if it wasn't important. I'll cut to the chase. We need a tracker. Eight of us were able to escape the initial breach. We've set up a new base of operations to track the anomalies and come up with a solution. I think we found a way to fix this whole mess. All we're missing is a tracker of sufficient skill to hunt down the source without alerting it. But we can take care of the rest. Again, I wouldn't be asking if you weren't the best. Communication to the station's limited due to the shard's climate, but there should be an upcoming window for safe transit. So I've attached coordinates to this message. I hope we see you soon. I'll be back in these waters in two weeks. I'll give you a call and see if you need pickup. Good luck out there. Nice one, Sam. Warm and fuzzy as ever. Maybe we'll have some time to work on your manners between saving the world or something. <clears throat> Field report from tracker Artemis, on site at coordinates 76 degrees south by 27 degrees west, attempting to make contact with the team stationed at a base in the vicinity. No visible wildlife or locals, hostile or otherwise. If found, please deliver this log and, if possible, my remains to the West Bay Diesel Nomads. Locked. Maybe I can blast it off? Whoa, 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 all right, bad idea. <laughs> uh, maybe I can knock down that body from the roof. They must have a key. Not the most graceful solution, but, um, you know, hey, <laughs> if it works. Artemis, this is Dr. Crane. You're probably surprised to be hearing from me. I promise I wouldn't be reaching out if it wasn't important. I'll cut to the chase. We need a tracker. Eight of us were able to escape the initial breach. We've set up a new base of operations to track the anomalies and come up with a solution. I think we found a way to fix this whole mess. All we're missing is a tracker of sufficient skill to hunt down the source without alerting it. We can take care of the rest. Again, I wouldn't be asking if you weren't the best. Communication to the station's limited due to the shard's climate, but there should be an upcoming window for safe transit. So I have attached coordinates to this message. I hope we see you soon.
Anyone home? It's your tracker. Hope y'all have some fresh seal meat or something on the grill. <laughs> uh, okay. Location confirmed as Arc 2. Interior of base is cold. Likely been abandoned in at least a week. I'm gonna try and locate the generator. With any luck, I'll at least have a warm place to rest until retrieval. Guess you and your friends were busy, huh, Sam? Hey there, Artemis. It's Dr. Crane. Look, I know it's been a while, and I don't want to intrude, but we need your help. We've been working on a fix to all of this, a way to kill the cognito virus. It's not really a virus. I can explain it all when you get here. We've collected samples from some of the most aggressive shards, but it's getting dangerous. And we need someone that can get us in close without raising the alarm. That's where you come in. I've attached some coordinates to this message, and I really hope you decide to join us. Oh, God, that was way too confusing. I'm going to go again. It's been a while. It's been eight fucking years. Encountered the team's operations room. Documents on site indicate some kind of plan to destroy the Cognito virus. Still no signs of the team. Located key to the generator. Gonna try and get the base up and running again. Let there be light. Warning. Catastrophic collapse detected in underground testing facility. Please proceed to area to assess damage and disengage alarm. Uh, wonderful. Time to head down. Hopefully I don't need to fetch like a key from the damn roof or something. asked for this one. <sighs> the fuck is that? That rope won't budge. Maybe one of the team had something that could cut it? I should check the bunk room.
I couldn't even hear myself think. Ugh. So this little gizmo is going to save the world. Huh. Error. Pneumatic sample transfer system blocked. Please check connection located in cold storage vault. Oh, come on. Oh. Well, on the bright side, I, was... I found a note that shed some light on what they were working on here. Seems the research team discovered a method of both neutralizing the cognitovirus and preventing further spread. Further information regarding the cognitovirus has been obtained and will be processed into a full report on conclusion of site sweep. Going to check the pneumatic sample transfer system now. A trench that's uh, almost as good as a tunnel, <laughs> except cold and exposed and somehow even creepier. Hmm. Interior sweep inconclusive. Roughly half a dozen rooms still inaccessible. Haven't located any further researchers, alive or otherwise. There are signs of a struggle and one of the rooms has been sealed off. Continuing search in on-site vault. Well, spoke too soon. Identified another researcher, not Dr. Crane. Okay, I should be able to use that computer in the lab to retrieve samples. Let's just hope there's not some kind of a bomb or plague monster in the tunnel. You know what? <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm not gonna jinx it. Hey there, Artemis. It's Dr. Crane. Look, I know it's been a while, and I don't want to intrude, but we need your help. We've been working on a fix to all of this. A way to kill the cognitovirus. It's not really a virus. I can explain it all when you get here. We've collected samples from some of the most aggressive shards, but it's getting dangerous. And we need someone that can get us in close without raising the alarm. That's where you come in. I've attached some coordinates to this message, and I really hope you decide to join us. Way too confusing. I'm gonna go again. Hey, Sky. This one's just for you. Things here are quiet, but shit clearly went down. There's something else I just can't put my finger on. 
It's like this whole place is trying to push me out somehow. Like one of those inflatable carnival obstacle courses for kids. You can get through it if you try, but it's always pushing back. But gods, if the stars aren't just damn beautiful out here, I mean, if you think those babies sparkle on the plains, then you gotta try a thousand miles from the nearest flashlight. It's still another 13 days until pickup, and I already miss you. It'll be a cold night, even with the generator on. Wish I had you here to help me with that. Hope you're keeping the dogs close. Chloe always gets nervous when I'm gone, but you already know that. It's one of the big reasons I love you. I'll be home soon to tell you all this in person. If not, tell mom I still haven't found her yet. You know, it's kind of cozy if you ignore the, uh, death. First night on site, passed without incident. Several locked doors prevent conclusive sweep. Going to continue facility investigation. Primary goal, discover location of research team. Group's research is possible lead. I am a ghost hunter. I've been sent to investigate a newly constructed shopping mall along Road 45. The construction company of course wanted to keep this off the books, requiring me to conduct my investigation at night. Doesn't bother me at all. Unusual work hours is a part of the job. After a long trip here, I'm eager to see what stories this place holds for me.
This all started after my grandmother died. I was the only one she could communicate with, and we talked a lot, became closer than we ever were when she was alive. After a while though, she told me where to find her old camera, this one. Turns out she'd been a ghost hunter as well, and wanted me to continue her legacy. I was instructed how it worked, and it was our last goodbye. She was the first spirit I photographed.
is probably the wrong word if you think about it. A very specific flash and film type is needed to capture a ghost. But it isn't the spirit itself that's captured. It captures the negative emotions that keeps them here with us. It isn't really about defeating some malevolent force. It's about empathizing.
Ideally, our death is quick and painless, but history is full of the opposite. It's the bad intentions and tragic outcomes that really haunts a place. There are a lot of stories hiding in the dark corners of the earth. I've had the opportunity to witness countless, and I know I've only scratched the surface. If there's one thing I've learned, it's that we all want someone to take a moment and listen to us, even if we're dead. Well, I think it's time for a cup of good hot black coffee. Ghosts never sleep, do they? I have seen some rough places on the fringe, but just what were you thinking, Sam? You're a doctor, not some kind of commando. Ugh. It appears the group had been conducting expeditions to collect samples for some kind of weapon. According to these files, there should be seven samples, each associated with a different expedition. Well... Sky did always tell me I should read more. Gods, I have... And that did something, I think. Uh, guess I'll just have to get the rest. First sample retrieved and inserted into the device. No obvious changes. Continuing research and sample collection.